The Casper is an unusual vehicle, being in service in much the same form not only with several South African police forces but also with the South African National Defense Forces in a virtually identical form. It was originally developed for the rigorous conditions of Namibia, where a very high mine threat was prevalent. The first prototype was built in 1979 by TMF Limited. The Casper was originally based on a Bedford heavy commercial truck chassis but this was gradually modified and strengthened so that the Casper can be taken as an original design. Production commenced in 1981. Since then over 2500 have been produced and many have been rebuilt to extend their service lives, as production ceased in the early 1990s. During its active service the Casper has earned a reputation for protection, reliability and durability. The Casper resembles an armored truck with the armor extending to specially shaped under hull plates intended to reduce the effects of land mines. During its service life Casper demonstrated that they can indeed survive heavy mine detonations. Some have been specially equipped for detecting and clearing mines from roads in remote areas. The cab roof has provision for a weapon station, usually a single 7.62mm general purpose machine gun, but police vehicles may have all manner of anti-riot weapons, including a rapid-firing rubber bullet dispenser. The troops, or police, are seated on outward-facing bench seats down the center of the rear compartment and are provided with vision blocks and firing ports. Police versions usually have larger vision blocks covered by grills. Entry to the rather high off-the-ground compartment is via a door in the rear. Large roof hatches are provided. This mine-protected vehicle used a number of Mercedes-Benz commercially available driveline and suspension components. Vehicle is powered by Atlantis diesel engines 352T diesel, developing 170 horsepower. Essentially it was a Mercedes-Benz OM352 diesel, license produced in South Africa. This engine was used on Mercedes-Benz Unimog vehicles and L-Series commercial trucks.